Hello, Taurus. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for sharing your energy with me. This is a general reading for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, whatever else you feel like it. If it fits, it fits. Taurus, when I was meditating on your energy, I got the definite impression that that Six of Wands, those small little victories that were coming in, are continuing. Okay? I also got, you got something else. You got something else you want to start. You want, you got something else that's starting. You've got some energy coming in that you have been calling in. Whether or not you've real, you re, no, you realize it, but you may not realize that you've been actually calling it in. Um, something that you've been wanting is coming. Okay. I'm getting, I'm getting just a, 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 an underlying, oh, well, isn't that nice kind of a thing. Okay. Past, present, it's nothing earth shattering, I don't think, but it's pleasant, it's nice. More Six of Wands energy is what I'm getting. Okay. In the past, the reason for the reading is the Two of Swords, making a decision, Nine of Wands, being conflicted, making a decision in, in a matter that was very difficult. Let's see what your past energy is. King of Wands, you took action. You took action on something that you contemplated on. I don't know why I'm getting home, but we'll see. Okay, currently, the world. A new cycle is starting. Let's see what we got with that, shall we? Oh, the devil. With the six of wands. Yes, a new cycle. What's with Capricorn here? Capricorn energy with the devil. You are gaining the upper hand. That's exactly what that is. You're gaining the upper hand in a situation that you took on. A situation you've been working on. A situation that's been going, that's been an ongoing sense of nine of wands. Yeah, okay, we don't need to pull a card on that. What else is with it? Along with the eight of swords. You've got all these little victories going on in this situation, but you feel like you're trapped by it. You feel like you're trapped in this situation. What's this Eight of Swords, please? Strength, Leo. Wheel of Fortune. Justice. Three major arcanas in a row. Two major arcanas over here. Five of Cups on the bottom. We have the Knight of Wands with the, with the Nine of Wands. Wow, okay. All right, so you're stuck in your head about whether or not you're going to have the strength to come through this to make this situation not so toxic. If you're going to be able to be victorious and bring balance to, to the sadness, to this feeling left out. That's what the Eight of Swords is all about. You're doubting whether or not you're going to be able to overcome this devil energy, but you are having Six of Wands. You're having all these small victories in this toxic situation. You're still moving forward, even though you're battered and bruised. And look what's right below that. The devil. And under that, we have the star and the queen of wands. Okay. Moving forward, being battered and bruised. It is toxic, but it will. you have faith it's going to heal. You absolutely do have faith it's going to heal. You have the strength because not only are you wondering if you have the strength to turn this wheel to bring in the justice, but you do have the strength to turn this wheel to bring in the justice so that this, so that you're not left out in the cold anymore. Okay, in the future, we have the Four of Swords. That is rest, 
recuperation, meditation, going within, and I'm also getting a journey. I'm also getting a trip. You got the Knight of Swords with the Hierophant, the Emperor. How many major arcanas do you need, Taurus? With the Ten of Wands. On the bottom, we have the Queen of Cups with the Four of Pentacles. Four of Swords, resting and recuperating, meditating, going over everything that you have accomplished, everything that you have gained up to this point, being grateful for what you have because you did not lose it. You didn't lose your shit either because of this toxic situation. Knight of Swords, rushing in, Hierophant, order, Emperor, order, Ten of Wands, it's a burden. It's a burden. Bringing order to this situation is a, is a burden. But you can do it. You can do it. Really? The chariot. Okay. So you're going to gather your resources here. You're going to see what resources you do have. You're going to move forward quickly, but successfully, successfully, whatever this battle is, whether it's at work, at home, with family, within yourself, you are going to be victorious. You have the chariot here. Let's go over it. Leo, Libra, Capricorn, um, Taurus, there you are, Emperor Aries, but that's you, and Cancer. Okay, and what's this chariot card? What's this? Woo! Seriously? Real quick. Four of Pentacles, Queen of Cups, Three of Pentacles. You're holding on to the hope of teamwork, Pisces, Hangman energy, because you want you're you're you want others to see the stable foundation that is possible with planning, bringing in a tower, cutting things off because you're using your intuition, you're using knowledge that you've gained over here for equal, equal reciprocity. Moon, Pisces, Ace of Cups. You're not sure how to get here yet. You're not sure how to get here yet, but you will be. You will be. We got Pisces. Um, Aries and Scorpio, High Priestess is Sagittarius, Pisces, Virgo, Moon is Pisces, and Cancer. And finally, that brings us to the Five of Wands, Internal Conflict. I'm getting a different deck because you've already taken pretty much half the Ar Major Arcana out of that one. Wow, you've got the support. You've got the support, okay? If you're feeling like you're fighting this battle alone, you may not see it, but you do have the support system. In people, in, in from spirit side, in person, whatever, you have the support system to, to deal with this. Six of Pentacles, again. Six of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles. All right. You're learning, you're growing. Oh, you're gonna get so much. Oh, this is gonna be good. This is gonna be so good. This is gonna end on such a good note. You have no idea the victory that's coming in for you. Three of Rods, the Magician. Yeah, finally, yes, the Hierophant and Two of Rods. On the bottom, we have the Queen of Swords and the Seven of Swords with the Four of Cups, cutting out the sneakiness and the individual me, me, me from a situation because you're dealing with either another person or people where it's a me situation. That's going to get cut out. Balance is going to be restored and you're going to figure out exactly what needs to be implemented so that you can make a choice. Wow. Wow. What a wild ride. Taurus, what an absolutely crazy wild ride. Do not give up. Do not lose faith. Continue to hold on to all of those small victories that are coming in right now. They're not going to stop. They're not going to stop. And they're going to lead you to where you need to go. Okay? 
Don't lose faith. You have so much energy coming in to help you. Yes, absolutely. This is this is going to turn out so much better than you thought. Whatever this is. Imprisonment and slavery at the root of the matter is fear of imprisonment, really. Deep down, let me have another one. Uh -huh, there we go. Others around you may very well be fearing that the, they don't matter. That they don't matter. They don't see how they matter. They don't see their true selves. They're not taking personal responsibility because they don't understand their own impact on others. But you do have angels working with you. Okay. Don't fear that you're trapped in this situation either. Don't fear that you're trapped in this situation. You're not trapped in this situation. You actually have a lot more control over it than what you think. And you have a bigger impact than what you think. Okay, we have eight of air. An illusion of being trapped. I cannot make this up. A lack of self-confidence, afraid to take action. Oh, I cannot even make that up. Oh, my God. Seven of fire. Defend your beliefs and decisions. Stand your ground. Choose your battles wisely. I'm going to read both of these again because these are perfect. An illusion of being trapped. A lack of self-confidence. Afraid to take action. Defend your beliefs and decisions. Stand your ground. Choose your battles wisely. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Reaching your destination. Your light is shining brightly. You are on the path you're supposed to be on. Stop doubting yourself. Breaking trail. A breakthrough is at hand. Told you. Yes, I knew it. I knew it, Taurus. I could feel it. I told you it was going to come through good. I knew it. Have faith, guys. You totally have this. You have this. Be strong. You are Taurus. Remember who you are. Okay? You have the ability to overcome whatever this toxic situation is. Even if it's just a mindset within yourself, you have the ability to do this. You've got this, Taurus. You guys have a great week. I am going to see you soon. Peace to you. Ciao.